Responding to outrage in Congress, Defense Secretary Ashton Carter has told the Pentagon to stop trying to recover questionable bonuses paid to National Guard members who a decade ago accepted the money for re-enlisting and fighting in Iraq or Afghanistan. Sandra Ali joins us now from the newsroom with the latest on this one. Sandra. Karen, that's right. You know, just days after that published report claimed thousands of California National Guard members were actually being pursued by the Pentagon to pay back those suspect bonuses they received for re-enlisting a decade ago, Defense Secretary Ashton Carter is now stopping that payback process. I've ordered the suspension of all efforts to collect reimbursement from affected California Guard members. Carter's decision follows the Los Angeles Times story over the weekend that nearly 10,000 California Guard members have been ordered by the Pentagon to repay bonuses they received during what turned out to be a recruiting scandal. We just stepped forward, we volunteered, we signed on the line, we did our duty, and now they're slapping us in the face for it. Former Guard member Robert D'Andera was among those in 2006 or 2007 who received a bonus of $15,000 or more to re-enlist for more combat in Iraq or Afghanistan. An investigation in 2011 determined those bonuses were an error or illegal. Several California Guard recruiters pled guilty to fraud, but at the same time, the Pentagon pursued payback from the soldiers, which elected officials on both sides of the aisle now call outrageous. And now there's also some real concern that this reenlistment bonus scandal may stretch actually outside of the borders of California, something, of course, we will continue to follow. Karen Devin, back to you.